Hey guys, welcome back to the Parkiverse. Today, I thought we'll look at something quite different. The new experimental redesign of Google Chrome, which along with bringing a brand new design language, also revamps the way that we interact with the browser itself. And for sure, those of you running Windows 11 are definitely going to love this new take. But before we get started, if you guys want to grab yourselves these live wallpapers, just simply head over to my very own Epic Live Wallpaper app, where you can grab it all for free. So here it is, the brand new experimental look for Google Chrome in 2023. Now this version is technically not publicly available yet, but with a couple little tweaks, I'm going to show you exactly how you can grab it for yourselves in literally under a few minutes. Now of course, putting aside the visual changes, where they've added in extra curves to line up with the Windows 11 look, they've also switched up the address bar, the tab section, and also the side panel. Additionally, with this version, you get a brand new history section, which you can access at any point by simply clicking on this downward arrow. So now any recently closed tabs can easily be accessible at any time. So now instead of having to dig through the side panel, you can easily access it in an instant and even search within that list itself. Definitely quite handy. And for those of you who rely heavily on bookmarks, the side panel has been updated to allow us to sort websites and even now quickly manage multiple websites or even groups of them with just a few clicks. Oh and of course, you can also customize Chrome just as before with a wide array of themes supporting this new look. Now to get this set up in your system, just simply head to the settings section and then about Chrome. Here you want to make sure you have the latest version installed and once done just click relaunch. So now that you're on the latest version, make sure to head over to Chrome colon slash slash flags where you'll be able to enable some experimental features. So feel free to take your time and have a good look around because there might be some features that you want turned on. But here for this guide, using the search bar, just simply type in Chrome Refresh. At which point you need to enable both of these options here, the Chrome Refresh 2023 and the Chrome Web UI. After which there's one more we need to enable, that's Customize Chrome Side Panel. Now just simply click Relaunch and there you have it, you now have the experimental Google Chrome enabled. Now having used this for a couple days now, it's definitely a lot more streamlined and things do feel slightly more accessible. Now as a disclaimer, keep in mind this version is truly experimental, so there might be a couple different bugs or hiccups from time to time, but personally speaking, I haven't really come across anything major. I mean there is currently a slight bug where you can't resize the window from the top, but really it's not that big a deal. Now if you guys like this video and want to see more like this, Android customization tips and tricks, as well as home screen setups, make sure to like and subscribe. See you guys next time on Into the Parkiverse.